Okay, pause. There she is. That is the female fan fin sea devil. She's out here floating like an underwater disco queen, surrounded by her bioluminescence, and she's a spectacular creature for a lot of reasons. She has the famous anglerfish appendage, that bulb with the bioluminescence light that attracts prey. Her fins are also quite unlike other fish fins that are connected by membranes. Hers are split apart, each working off an individual muscle, like this wide whisker-like network where she can attract prey. Rewind, zoom in, that is bachelor number one, the male fan fin sea devil. Now, this is the first time that he's ever been seen. And you'll also notice that it's even hard to see him here because he's so much smaller than she is. He's here with his big lady. She is 16 centimeters, he's only three. That makes him 60 times smaller than she is and about half a million times less than she weighs. And you'll also notice that he looks pretty different and that's because their life purposes are different. He doesn't have a cool appendage, he doesn't have the whiskers, but what he does have are these big eyes and these big nostrils because essentially he spends all of his days looking through the deep sea for his lady. And when he finds her, he's achieved his life purpose. So good for you, deep sea anglerfish boy. So what are we watching now? These two fish are now participating in repeated spawning events, AKA sweet, sweet lovemaking in the world of deep sea anglerfish. He, once he swims up, has taken these teeth that have evolved to grasp and he bites into her stomach because he's technically a sexual parasite. When he bites onto her stomach, the tip of his nose and his chin, those tissues fuse into her tissues. Their circulatory systems fuse. They are now just one big fish. And technically, that's romantic here. Fan fin sea devils take the idea of until death do us part very seriously because that's literally what's gonna happen to them. He lives so long as she lives. She's providing nutrients for him for the rest of his life. He's just floating along, going for the ride, this committed relationship. You know, just like every little girl dreams of. <laughs>